Hello? Hello, hello? All right. Uh, I'm not. I'm not feeling the vibe of this music. Who, who, who's there? Raptor. What? Uh, what's going on? <coughs> yeah, there we go. That's a little bit better. Right. All right, let's see. I was getting my camera set up. I was getting, hold on. Let me, let me figure some things out real quick. Uh, I need to move lightly over. So what if I just... Did that. I need to do that. There we are. Chicken attack. Chicken attack. I need to see. do this so I can read. All right. Oh my God. Miniature that I'm going to be painting. It's uh, real flimsy. But I mean, to be fair, it's 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 pretty cheap. It's a pretty, pretty cheap quality. All right. Let's, uh, I'm kind of tired today. I had an energy drink earlier, but I don't know if it's, I don't think it's kicked in yet, even though it should have by now. Neat, wait, ooh, three, three stream streak. Raptor, what do you what do you need? Ch chickens? Is that is that what you need? Hold on, I need to make some I need to make some posts real quick. You can talk. Oh neat. <laughs> I was like, what? It's all right if you messed up. Everybody messes up. Oh, fuck. Fuck me. Like, I almost just messed up. All right. Uh, what am I doing today? I'm painting miniatures. Miniature painting. And I'm still all stuffed up from being sick. For like a week. Last night, last night I took like two Benadryls. Oh, I slept like a fucking rock. Had some weird fucking dreams, but it was worth it. It was worth it to be able to actually like sleep for once. And not like wake up every like five hours. Due to, you know, whatever. Whatever reason. Uh, uh, 
let's see here. All right, let's let's get this started. All right. Nope, not playing games today, Elgato. That is not your job. That is not your job today. Okay, we're gonna go with... That. There you go with that. All right. <laughs> so I got whatever this thing is. So these these are like the really kind of like cheap looking like miniatures that you get at the game store. Um, I think they were like two bucks. But I have this like dwarf dwarf miner dude actually i need to change the light on this uh, uh, yeah he, he definitely is a definitely a rocking stone guy I don't know. I don't know what lighting is better. Just <laughs> all my all my lighting sucks. And then, yeah. So I guess these miniatures. I I don't have to prime them. That's why they're they're like this. So we're gonna see how that goes. Um, the box suggests the not to prime them. Don't know why. but it's just supposed to be ready out of the box. I think, I think I'm going to try some, maybe try some new techniques on these guys. And if I mess up, then uh, no harm, no foul. Because they were cheap. So. All right. Uh, I think we'll start with the, the rock, the rock and stone guy. You're gonna join friend on VR chat. All right, Raptor, have a have a fun time. No, my camera. Okay, never mind. <laughs> it's my camera thought it like disconnected for a second there. All right, have fun with your lurk. I'll be here if you want to come back. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hold on. Is that? I'm going to try another port. Another USB port. No, I don't want to do that one. <laughs> okay, now everything should be okay. Please, camera, don't don't do this to me today. 
All right, so we're going to go with flesh color for the skin. I think we're going to go with the... I think we're going to go with a hot orange. Where's the hot orange? The hot orange for the, uh, the facial hair that we got going on. So we'll start with that. Start with the face and the... He's wearing gloves. But... He does have some forearm. Okay. Let's see. Where's my brush? <clears throat> this guy's pretty tiny. Can't tell if my paint's too thin or if it's because they don't suggest to prime. Just the paint stain on there, really weird. Well, hmm. no, I think it's fine. It's really weird there for a second. I'm really sad that I wasn't able to do any painting last week. <laughs> but I was, I did work on a, on painting a Gundam though. Ugh. So it wasn't all bad. Oh, you know what? I'm going to use this. Oh, I, I forgot. I need my hands. So now it's hot in here. Whoop. All right. Oh, oh, oh shit. All right, that's better. At least for the most part. All right. Is that a pill bottle? It is a pill bottle. <laughs> it's just uh what I use what I used to hold. Uh my stuff. But uh how's it going? How you doing today?
Um, I don't really know. So, uh, hold on. Let me, it's, uh, what brand is it? I think it says on the bottom. Reaper Miniatures. So that, that's the brand. It's like that really cheap brand that you find at like game stores. But yeah, it's like a dwarf. Um, like a mine, um, a dwarf with a, with a pickaxe. It's a, uh, it's, it's really weird. I don't know if you can see it. Maybe. There we go. I'll focus a little bit better. It is, uh... Not all that great quality of a miniature. Like, why is one of his ears pointed and the other one not? Did part of his ear fall off? I wonder if part of his ear fell off. Like, we'll see. We'll have to see what a second coat of this looks like. It's not, it's not looking too. Too, too good right now. I'm also, I'm also using model color for this skin, which is a little different than game than game color. Can't tell if that's that's his skin or if that's a shirt. There's like a part. That kind of looks like a muscle. Should I say fuck it? 
Fuck it, it's a muscle now. And if it doesn't look right, we can make it a shirt. Details on this model isn't great. I should have started out with something darker anyways. What's the difference? So model color is a little bit more viscous. Um, game, game color is a little bit more watered down. So with model, co mo model color, you just kind of have to thin it out a little bit more. I mean, they're both, they're both, they're both Vallejo, right? So, so they're, they're made by the same, um, but the, this game color is created for like gaming miniatures while model color is made for like, um, I guess diorama miniatures, if that makes sense. Like you'll find this at like hobby stores. But you'll find this at game stores, like game hob like game hobby stores. Mm-hmm. Actually, where? Mm -hmm. I don't know if I really like the... I'm going to see... Kind of wanted to tone down that 
I think it was, I think it was too pink. Man, sorry for this, the sniffles. I'm still kind of congested from being sick. It's getting better, though. It should be mostly fine by tomorrow. Yeah, there we go. That's a little better. That second coat really helped. <clears throat> Come on, focus, thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm <coughs> uh, excuse me. <sighs> All right, let's. So he has like big, big bushy eyebrows that we're just gonna. We're just gonna assume all of this is just eyebrow.
I think I need to go <clears throat> thinner with this paint. I'm going to need to figure out how to like get some shadows in there. <coughs> <laughs> CVE, what's going on? Cosmo, how's it going? Definitely, I think I need to go back, and take some details on the skin. Oh, you got your new router and modem? Oh, and it's so much better. Oh, that's good. A new, a new, a new router does, can do uh, wonders <coughs> for uh, internet, internet connections or internet speeds. The, route, the router do be routering. <coughs> I wish our router did the routering. I can't, I can't tell if, if our shitty Wi-Fi is because of the router or if it's because our house is older. And, you know, we have, like, thick walls. But the thing is, like, our router shouldn't be a problem because it's brand fucking new. The router, the router is like, fuck, how old? How, when will we move in here? October? No, like November ish? Only like, like three months. We've only been living here for like three months. And like sometimes I can, I can barely watch like movies and shit. <laughs> Matters the spectrum non standard. Uh oh. I think I think ours is like that too. That you have to use like the website. Um but we don't we don't have spectrum. We have a uh, the T-Mobile? No. Verizon? 
think it's, it's, it's one of the cell phone companies. I think it's Verizon. <laughs> and like, like our friend was like, get Ver get get it, because it's so much better than the other internet that we have out here. And we're like, all right, whatever you say. Yeah, it's Verizon, Verizon Fios or whatever. Oh, I think that's too much weight. I just want to make his head shiny or look shiny. Let's see, <laughs> it's you don't know what it means. Yeah, so generally, generally, if you're doing any sort of if you're messing around with your settings for your Radom, you just go to your your home. You, you type you type in the home address or whatever uh, into your web browser and it'll take you to the to the router settings. <coughs> yeah, it's like the one nine two point one six eight point point one point one or whatever. Right. And then you can you can do all your shit. But like. I, I think I think more Internet service providers are going like to like the website method now where you have like a website that you do it do it through which i think is dumb but whatever nothing you can really do about it unfortunately like you just nowadays you can't just not have internet right Yeah, I was like I wasn't sure about about getting the Verizon because I know like cell phone companies are usually like notoriously bad when it comes to internet. Like like home internet. But um apparently it's better than the other internet provider that's in our area. But I guess for us, it didn't really matter because we have internet problems anyways. Or at least Wi-Fi. We have problems with Wi-Fi. But the only thing that's connected to Wi-Fi is our TV and our, and our PlayStation. I even had so many problems, I had to go go out and buy an Ethernet for my Switch. Because if I didn't, I wasn't going to be able to play Splatoon. <coughs> Which would have been terrible. Actually, it probably wouldn't have been that terrible. Not being able to play Splatoon. God, the fucking... The fucking Splatfest theme. It's fucking garbage. Ah, oh, fuck me. I'm way too far. <laughs> yeah, well... 
nothing I can do about it. Well, well, about the internet at least. I can't do something about my my mediocre art skills. It's a leap year. Yes, it is. It is a leap year. <laughs> I wish I wish oh you know what it's going out of focus because it's focusing on other shit I always got to remember, I have to take like everything else out of the shot or out of the camera or else it won't focus correctly. It's also election year for the United States. I hope everybody's ready for that shit. Hope every hope everybody's ready for the shit shows that's gonna be happening. Medical, what's going on? <coughs> you were, were you, sh you were sh streaming earlier today, right? I was gonna come into the stream. But then I forgot. Like I saw, I saw like the, I saw you you post on on my Discord. I was like, oh, I should go check it out. And then like, I was watching a movie and my TV batteries ran low, and I was like, I don't have any batteries left, so I need to go to the store. And so I went to the store and I came back, and I just continued watching the movie. And I totally forgot all about it. Is that a rock and stone door? Stone door? Yeah. Yeah, it's a rock and stone door. I'm trying my best. It's a... Uh, not, it's not a, super, it's not, not a super great miniature. What? Come on, paint. <laughs> Can't always do too much paint. Last time it was not enough. Now it's too much. Let's see. They're gonna cheat again. Accuse law by citizens. Treason. Build a wall. Around the White House, ten feet higher. Kalama, what are you what are you what are you going on about? <coughs> What's going on, Ari? Hmm. Well, that's good. I'm glad you feel good. Oh, I need a different brush for this. <clears throat> and more paint. <sighs> like, there's this, there's this color. Right, 
And it's supposed to be game color, but it's so watered down, it might as well be an ink. <laughs> I feel like they put the wrong... The wrong label on it. Because it's so watery. I don't even have to do anything. But this miniature doesn't like the really watered down paint. It won't like it here. Oh man. That's going a little bit too wild with the paintbrush. All right, better go clean your room then. It's always better to do it when you're motivated than when you're not and you don't just don't care. Man, I want this color to work. <sighs> Man. Oh, don't oh, shit. Uh, so this is like a this is like a cheap miniature, right? I think it was like two bucks or some shit like that. And uh, it's not a very good quality. And so some of the details are like mushed together. <laughs> so so it's they're the reaper miniatures and you'll find them at like uh a uh, hobby like game stores right um like the cheap cheap looking D, D miniatures and uh i don't know they were like 50 percent off they're on sale And like these particular ones, say not to like prime them. Actually, they against priming them. And I can see why. I have a feeling if you try to prime them, you'd lose any and all detail that's on this on this miniature that you can barely, you know, barely tell. <laughs> It's cheap until you make it not cheap. I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, if I can get it looking like, you know, pretty decent <laughs> and then cool. I mean, it gives me an opportunity to try to. Like, do some like techniques. Really need to work on like skin. Skin a little bit more. I hate how this, I hate how this, I hate how this brown's turning out. Oh, you know someone that likes them? I don't, I don't know. Just, 
I mean, I guess like it's cheap if it's cheaply made, then obviously it's gonna be a cheap cheap model. More, it's more like I should have bought some like contrast paints to try out on these. So I'm wanting to try out some contrast paints. <clears throat> I mean this. This paint that I'm using right now is not doing a terrible job. It's weirdly giving me the kind of inconsistencies and in color that you'll like see on leather sometimes. Like the kind of like different shades you see on leather. You want to buy them? Oh, you, yeah, Hero Forge. Hero Forge is pretty cool. I like I like on Hero Forge how you can make models and then just buy the uh, the STL file, which. Which, once I get a 3D printer, I'll definitely be doing probably a lot of. I'll probably do some some model building on uh, on Hero Forge. <laughs> Definitely gonna have to do this. This glove over again. Yay. Yay, me. Hmm. You know, two-year D and D character built Dragonborn, <laughs> Dragonborn and Kobold. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think uh, I think my group is finally finally playing D and D again. <coughs> we had like the holidays, and well, first I moved, and then I had the holidays. And then we were just kind of busy. And now I think we're finally going to be playing tomorrow. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be great. We're going to have fun. Uh, let's see here.
You had to drop your bi-weekly, you had your bi- <laughs> You were in, you were in, you are doing two? Oh, let's see. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people play play on the weekends. I don't I don't know like I I kind of agree with you on wanting to play during the week cuz cuz once I get to the weekend I'm just like I don't want to do anything I just want to like stay home and play video games right so it's like if you're working all week and then finally Friday comes along and you get home Friday, you're just like, I don't want to, I don't want to do anything. I just, I just want to veg out and play video games, not, ha and not have to think or do math. Hmm. Where? I mean, even like even doing it online, I think it's, it's just too much, especially if you're because like most of the time I'd be like, you know, working with like people all day, which is not and then you just don't want to deal with people all day. You don't want to. You don't want to deal with people anymore. I think that was always my problem with uh, doing things on the weekend. Thank <laughs> you.
So many characters play, not enough time or games. You really have that many characters <laughs> that you want to play. Man, any character that I create for D&D is pretty much, it's almost, almost created like the last minute. For the most part. Like, I'll come up with like a backstory, like beforehand, if it's important. If the backstory is important to come up with it before the session or before the first session, then obviously I'll work on it. But <clears throat> I usually do like on the flow. Like I'll I'll make it up. I'll make it up as I go. <laughs>
Let's see. <coughs> It's a samurai fighter vengeance paladin? What? Can I just... What? What? What is a... What a... What is a samurai fighter vengeance paladin? What, what do they do? I'm I'm intrigued. Mm. You hit hard and you smite. All right. Hmm. <clears throat> People are more confused by the the. Uh, I mean, I mean, samurai fighter, vengeance paladin. I think that one's weirder. <laughs> Probably, probably cause like ven vengeance, like 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 why why the weird like why the <laughs> why like like is 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 that a is that a, is that a a D and D thing like like I don't I've never really heard people have like uh. Like, uh, what, what would that be? Like, an adjective? <laughs> or would that be a verb? Because you'd be like... <laughs> Gonna be samurai that lost their lore and be fueled by vengeance. Okay, gotcha. So So I'm I'm assuming the character is out for blood. I'm assuming they're out to kill someone. At least that's that would be my guess. Like, I just kind of want to play play characters who are just really bad at their class. Like, I'm playing I'm playing a, a human ranger right now. But they're really, really bad at it. They're they their aim is terrible. 
it's been really fun so far because it's actually it's actually working. I actually have really bad aim. It's great. And on the campaign, you have to make the build of a backstory that fits. Do you really need it to so the, the backstory fit? Or your DM can just, you know, make, make, your, or your DM can just go along with the, with the backstory that you've given them. <clears throat> Raptor, you're the one that left. <laughs> no, Ra Ra Raptor, that that is that is not that is not how this works. <laughs> No, no, don't you dare. Don't you dare bonk me. You're the one, you're the one that went, Flory, you're just not all that interesting to watch. I'm gonna go play VR instead. And then you're like, I don't, I don't need you for entertainment. That's what you said, right? How long has it been? It's been an hour and a half, and I don't have a whole lot of him <coughs> completed. All right, let's see here. I'm not entirely sure what his coat's made out of. But, uh, let's see here. We're gonna... Yeah, you see the... You're satisfied? Yeah, it seems like it's burlap. I, I, I'm gonna do... I'm probably gonna do, like, a... Like, a gray fur. Grays with some, like, white highlights. Make it look... Wolf. Like, wolf fur, I guess. Code is made of elf. I don't like 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 coat 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 made made out of skin. <laughs> is 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 that what we're doing now? We're it's funny time. We're we're making. We're making coats out of people. We're making coats out of people now. Yeah, oh, all right. It's Morbin time. Oh no. Flory, stop. She is Morbin all over the place. I'm not Morbin. 
not morbing all over the place. At least not yet. I'm not morbid yet. You'll know. You'll 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 know when you'll know when I'm morbid. It's not gonna it's not gonna be a pretty sight. <laughs> you know, I really need to practice my ada adas. Oh shit, I forgot to feed the man mouse. Uh, don't don't make me. <laughs> ara, ara. I'll have to, to get on working on working on that sexy voice. Maybe after I'm done being congested. Meow. God, I can't. <laughs> All right, I need I need to feed the kitties. I'll be right. Don't go anywhere. I need to feed the meow mouse. Have fun with the crabs. <coughs> <laughs> Not the chickens. Chicken Where are my kitties? Coming, coming back, coming back. Oh man, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta show you guys something real quick. I almost forgot. Oh, shit was going on my floor. Where you belong? All right. I was uh, well, I was out. I've been working on. Getting a, a Gundam painted. Any cool? It's looking pretty cool so far. I still need to like paint his hands and stuff. Where's the Ava crab? Oh fuck! In a box somewhere. Wow. Yeah, Ava crab. Ava crab's. He's fine. If a crab's still alive, don't worry. I didn't lose him. He's literally uh, really come on. I didn't lose him. He's not gone. Let me get him. Let me get him. Where's, where's crab? There he is. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me, let me get the crab. Let me just, let me get, let me get him. All right, here, here are my crabs.
I mean, my cute little crabs. I need more of these crabs. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. Where's... Where, no. I gotta cycle. There we go. You can't, you can't see it very well. What if I, oh, hold on. There's your, there's your crab rave. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, let me, let me, let me, let me turn off, let me turn off the light. Hold on, let me turn off that light. Hold on, hold on. Turn off that light. <sighs> we turn off that light. We turn off that light, and then hold on. Let me pick them up, and then we'll do. We'll put them up here, and then we'll block this one out. There you go. Now you can see it a little bit better. A crab rave. Need a tower of crab. We do need a tower of crab. I need more crabs. I did really well on these crabs. I want to make them. I want to make them different colors. Crab, crabbing around. All right. Gotta. Put him in. Put him in the background. What do you mean? You just, just. It's crab time. Reject humanity. Become crab. Yeah, yeah. Become crab. All right. <laughs> it's we're gonna continue painting. So I can get this mini done tonight. But <sighs> crab, crab, crab. Holy crab. Yeah, holy, <laughs> holy crab. Exactly. Holy crab is correct. Praise the crab. <laughs> Deep Crab Galactic. Crab and stone <laughs> to the shell. <laughs> Deep Crab Galactic? What the fuck? Just... It's... <coughs> Deep Rock Galactic, but they're all crabs. I think my husband's home and I think he found his titty pins. Came in the mail.
Okay. <laughs> he's do it. He's done simping for power. <laughs> yeah, man, 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 cool. that's what I that's what I call him. I think I think he'll be mad for for me talking about it. He just he just just <laughs> Well Raffer, he's not done. He's never done. He just likes you know He likes other other anime girls too. Oh, can't blame him. This this is not going well. <laughs> Let's just say he has a whole collection of pins that he has to hide when uh, people come to the house. Anime girls, yeah. Is you have a body? No, 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 no body pillows. <clears throat> no, 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 there aren't going to be any pre orders for any body pillows. I think, I think I'm going to need to choose a different color for this. There'll, there'll probably never be body pillows. I'm not that popular. Not enough. <clears throat> not enough people to simp for me yet. Maybe, maybe one day. But let's be honest, that might take a while. <laughs> mm. What is happening? Loan, thanks for the subscription. Man, 15 months. Loan, oh. thanks for the gift sub. <laughs> Your wife hates it when you spend mo <coughs> when you spend money on her. Cheer one hundred. Cheer one hundred. I don't think your wife hates it when you spend money on her. She she's. She's probably just mad that you don't think about, you know, normal, you know, household expenses. 
and how that money could be spent, you know, in other ways. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Oh, you know what? I, sh I should have put the lights back on. She's always upset. Do you spend money on me? Well, what what's got what's gonna happen when you find out, or when she finds out that you're spending money on me? I think she'll be more upset. <laughs> that won't happen. How do you know? How do you know that won't happen? Okay. I'm gonna make the pants green. Oh. It's our little secret. Thanks for the donation, Loden. Nice. That nice donation. I can't tell what that undershirt is supposed to be. It kind of looks like chain mail. I think I think I'll have that read as chain mail because it's. Where's that gray? There it is. Oh. <laughs> That'll make I'll make it shiny. And I need to redo the coat, but I was waiting for that to dry.
<laughs> Just this this paint doesn't like to stick to the model very well. And let's see if we can get this coat in better shape. Is it because I didn't prime it? I mean, yes. But, for the box, it goes, don't prime this miniature. And I go, okay. Always be prime well, I mean, apparently. Maybe. I mean, the only, the only can, reason why I could think of not priming it is because prime, if, if I would have primed it, it, it might have lost the small amount of detail that you can actually see. Some of the, the details. Hard to, it's hard to distinguish what, what is what. <clears throat> All right, Rafter, are you, are you sure you're, you're going to sleep? Cause I know, I know sometimes that's a lie. You, you say you're going to sleep and then you come back. <laughs> you will come back then. <laughs> how dare how dare me? I mean if you can't sleep, don't don't go on your phone. That's counterintuitive. Look, look, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want anyone to be like, oh, I can't sleep, but I stay up on my phone all night watching, watching you VTubers. <laughs> why can't, why can't I sleep? <laughs> yeah, exactly, Michael. <laughs> It's a, it's a... Wait, 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 hold on. Oh, you hear me screams playing Splatoon? I don't scream while playing Splatoon. <laughs> I don't call everyone stupid. Come come on. I don't yell during Splatoon. That's so rude to say. I don't scream during Splatoon. Stop. <laughs> no. What do you mean toxic gamer girl moment? No uh.
Vimo raid? No. <laughs> no. No, no, no uh, female rage. Oh, I don't do that. Just ask Kuru. I don't, I don't do that. Oh, <clears throat> thanks for the, all the hydrates. <clears throat> Guys are so mean. <laughs> oh my god I mean it is a it is a pretty funny story Look, I don't I don't rage at Splatoon. Kiki. I thought it sounded like Kiki was gonna freaking barf all over the floor. It was a false alarm. <laughs> what if I got taller? I don't I don't think I need to be taller. I'm, I'm already pretty tall. <laughs> no. No, no puke. She puked this morning. I already had to clean it up. I already had to clean up clean it up once. And Kiki will never, never puke on the, the hard floor, only on the soft surfaces like a couch. <laughs> she, she just won't. <laughs> Yeah, Kiki's Kiki's so fucking rude like that. Oh, that needs to be. I want that shoe to be darker.
Mm, fuck it. We're just the shoes just the shoes are just gonna be black. We're saying it's when it happens at three AM, I know, right? Freaking cat, cat puking on the floor will probably wake me up faster than a fucking nuclear bomb will. <laughs> they aren't in the pet, right? Yeah, I know. <clears throat> Cause it's like they can't they can't do it like downstairs in the middle of the night. It always has to be like in the hallway or in the bedroom. Where they're their puking noise freaking echoes through the halls. Always be puking. I feel like they're just trying to test us. <laughs> <laughs> Puke life. You know, freaking. They wouldn't try to eat their food whole. Maybe they wouldn't be puking it back up. To be fair, only Kiki does that. Eddie doesn't. Eddie doesn't scarf his food down. <coughs> Eddie rarely pukes. It's only Kiki. Mm, what time is it? Uh, Eddie freaking can't get him to stay off the freaking table. He keeps sleeping on it all day. <coughs> and it's like, come on, Eddie. Like, what are you doing here, buddy? I'm not pain in my butt. I should just clean the table off. There's nothing on there for him to sit on. Maybe he won't sit on the table. Or he won't sleep on the table. Because he's like, ooh, ooh, look, books. Like the hardest surface I can fucking sit on. God, it's such a weird cat. Let's see here. This <laughs> sounds like Bud Bud. Yeah, cats, cats just want to sit where you don't want them. Like, they know. They know they're not supposed to sit there. They do it anyways. <laughs> <laughs> his table. I 
I mean, to be fair, I mean, we don't really use it all that often. <laughs> <laughs> we don't even really eat at it either. The only reason why we got it is to play board games and invite people over to play D&D. &D. But, uh, that hasn't happened yet since we moved here. Probably won't. Or at least that's how I expect things to go. Because that's... That's just probably how it's gonna go. <laughs> Can't tell, like, what half of these things that are hanging on him are. They're formerly alive animals. I mean, like, <laughs> some, some of it. Well, I'm talking about the, the form in which the unalived animals are taking shape. I think that's like a coin pouch. <clears throat> <clears throat> uh oh, Kiki's got the zoomies. Okay, let's see what do we what do we have here. Run, Kiki. No. No, run, Kiki, run. The thing on his back kind of looks like a bedroll. Or like a tent.
Oh, Cosmo, is that what you're having problems with? OBS connecting to, uh, to Twitch. Did my cat meow a bunch right before taking off? Yeah, Kiki goes, Mrawl! and then she runs, and then she stops, and then she'll go, Mrawl! again. And then she really likes being being pet by my husband. So so he was just in the bathroom, right? And he comes out. And then Kiki runs into my office, which is just right there. And she did that because she expected my husband to come into the room to pet her. Because what he would do is he would come. So Kiki would be like, like, K Kiki likes to be like pet on the bed, right? So she'll run and she'll jump on the bed and then she'll like flop over. So like she'll flop over on the bed and then she like looks at you with like this face and she's like pet me. Right? But she really likes it when my when my husband does it. So she's always running in to like to like a room when like he comes out. <laughs> Cuz she's like pet me. She always wants pets. She's a she's a slut for pets. I think she knew I was talking about her. She trotted downstairs. <laughs> it's... Yeah, Kiki's a slut for pets. Yeah, she she's she's a she's a spoiled she's a spoiled brat. That's what she is. But you know what? It doesn't matter. Her life is short. Freaking treat her like a princess all she wants. Because let me tell you, if you if you don't if you don't Treat your pets like your kids. You're gonna, you're 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 gonna regret it when they're gone. You're gonna be like, I wish I, I wish I pet them more. I wish I played with them more. I wish I cuddled with them more. I'm always cuddling with Kiki. She, she fucking demands. She fucking demands it. I just be sitting on the couch. Even if I'm sitting on the couch for like five minutes, she's like, "Ooh, ooh, can I sit on your lap?" And I'll be like, "Really, Kiki? Right now, Kiki?" And then she'll be like, "What?" Okay, I'm not sure about these eyeballs. Definitely got a derpy, derpy look in. <coughs> Mine are here, but let's see. I need to do some touch ups on him. But he's pretty much done. Then I can move on to the other one that I have. I 
which that'll be fun. So he got pain on his arm. There we go. You regret not spending time, Chloe. Oh, oh, that's so sad. Oh, and Bud Bud. I like Bud Bud. Not uh, not the the greatest painted miniature. Oh, a lot of issues with the, <laughs> with the, with the model itself, but, uh, you know what? It's all right. Nothing needs to be perfect. As long as we're all, as long as I'm having a good time, right? <laughs> Looks better than what you could do. I mean, you. I mean, you'd be surprised if if you tried. You'd probably be surprised at what you could do. So, like, sometimes, sometimes you'll get pretty lucky, and like, the the paint falls in place, um, where you want it to the first time. Um, like, my, uh, my eyes aren't, they, they kind of suck. Actually, the beard could use more, a little bit more darker tones, so maybe some more highlights. You feel like an ogre with a paintbrush? <laughs> Well, I doubt that. I don't. Th I don't doubt you're you're an ogre with a paintbrush. Give him a little bit of life.
feel like like I don't know half half a painting is intentional and the other half is not intentional and you're just kind of trusting the process. I mean, don't paint on figure. <laughs> They're painted. <laughs> Damn it. Not, not the best miniature to work with. Definitely, it's definitely usable, though. Definitely usable. So it's like eight o'clock. I've been streaming for almost two and a half hours. Took me two and a half hours to get this guy done. <clears throat> there were a lot of distractions. Chat. A lot, lot, of, lot of distractions. No, I'm kidding. You guys are great. You guys aren't a distraction. <laughs> it's oh I love you guys you guys make things fun you guys are great man this is the scene that that this figure up against like the ones that I painted in the in the in the past it's so much different, like how the quality of the mini. Really makes a difference. Cause it's like the smaller the figure, the more you have to be aware of how much paint you're putting on it. Cause the thicker amount of paint you put on it, the more disfigured it's gonna look. But I couldn't prime it. And so, in order to get coverage, I had to put the paint on pretty thick. <laughs> so like, so like here, here's this guy, who is like, who looks uh, okay, right? Like, some of the details are kind of, like, s smushed together. Like, whatever that thing on his on his little belt is. I don't even know what that is. I was like, I guess I'll paint it something. And then, like, compare that to, like, this bigger model. Which is beautifully painted. Like, the paint isn't, isn't thick. Be able to do like more work with like the detail. <laughs> yeah, I mean, she's, she's probably this one's probably one of one of the one of my favorites that I've painted so far. Like she came out really good. And then you have this guy. <laughs> I mean, even even that compared to like this one. This one, I mean, it's detail, but it's bigger detail. And like the paint's not as like heavy on it. Or which one? The first one? Yeah. Yeah, I really like that. That's a uh, color skin. And like with that like color, like purple with the hair. <sighs> so. 
we'll see if maybe we can get this one done. I have another Reaper miniature one. I have a bunch of them of this brand of miniatures. Once again, it doesn't want me to prime it. It says not to prime it. So I was like, all right, well. And like you can tell on this one, a lot of the detail is like. You can't. You can barely tell. Like it's all kind of like smushed together. It's all kind of like blending in. And like I I think this this is supposed to be like I, I want to say it's supposed to be like a fireball. It has a, it has a face on it. How much was this one? This one? I don't know. I think it was like the same price as the other one. Probably like a couple bucks. I I wasn't the one who bought them. But it's real, real, real flimsy. Really, really flimsy. Plastic. At, at like at first, at first glance, this thing looks like a chicken wing. <laughs> because because the, the hands the hand kind of blends into whatever this is yeah like a, a necrotic fireball it like blends in and so it looks like the hand is actually part of whatever this is and it makes it look like like a chicken wing sort of like a deformed chicken wing which i think is hilarious I think I'll probably just do some some basic coloring. I want to try to get maybe like a blue. You want? We'll go simple on this one. We'll try to go simple on this one. Let's see if I'm able to do. Let's see if I'm able to do that. Then maybe some more white. Do do. All right. Well, this is going to take multiple coats. Yeah, I like this blue.
need to try to get a little bit more even coverage of this. <clears throat> hmm. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna take this blue and I'm gonna try to gradient it into black at the end because it like goes it goes out. Also, this is a if I would have a better time with this brush. Oh, come on. Wait, something that I missed that I have to miss.
Let's see. I can't hear. <laughs> Leave the landlord deal with the water and the, the crippled guy. <laughs> Cosmo. The crippled guy? Really? Let's see. Really walk here and they have me trying to get the water out of what? <laughs> Wait. Sounds like they're trying to get free labor out of you, Cosmo. I'm pretty sure that's not in your lease. And plus, if there's water in your car, but you have a Seems like you have a like a leak. There's a leak somewhere. You should be like, oh, okay, but you're not gonna like my rates. You'd be like, yeah, here's. <laughs> Here's my rates. Good luck trying to afford me. Or to afford the guy that, that I hire. To, you know, fix shit. It was their birth pipe that caused it. Well, yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. You know he explained <laughs> Yeah. Actually, Cosmo, that might work depending on what state you're in. That that might that might be legal. Well, it might be illegal, depending on what state you're in, but it also could be legal to withhold rent. I think I've heard that from people before. That if your landlord refuses to, like, fix stuff and you hold, you hold back the rent or whatever... That it's, it's legal for you to do so. You might have to look up your, your renting laws. Yeah, and then they would have to replace the entire carpet, which is probably a lot more expensive. Like, if they fix the pipe, right, and there's just water in the carpet, all, all, you, all you do is gotta get a freaking uh, carpet cleaner to suck out all the water and then put a fan there. To, to dry it out. All you do is have to get a, like, a carpet fan. You can freaking rent them at Home Depot.
and they can't increase the rent. I think I I think that's how it how it goes. I think it depends. You you might have to ask the internet for the for those answers. To see what's legal or not. Well, this blue's looking a whole lot better. Sort of. It was it was doing a lot better until I said something. Yeah, it, it, never, it never hurts to check out your the laws in your state regarding like your your renting your renters rights or whatever. In this Especially if health hazards are concerned. Landlords do be landlording out there. <laughs> J J Knight, what's going on? What? What landlords do be landlording? They do their scummy landlord tactics. Because they want to be a landlord, but they don't want to do their job. That's what landlording is. haven't I haven't had a landlord in a while so <coughs> but what's up Jade how's it going
in fact, we we thought of renting our Texas house out, but we're like, we just want to be done with Texas. <laughs> we we didn't want to we didn't want to be affiliated with that state anymore. So we're like, nah, we're we're just gonna sell the house. <laughs> you're sick, but you're getting better. Well, I'm glad I'm glad you're getting better. Seems like, seems like the sickness is going around. Sinus infection, upper respiratory stuff. I mean, just today, I like I finally, finally just had a day where I wasn't glued to a box of tissues. This. I need a. Hit a few days ago, very mild. <laughs> yeah. Mm, I don't know if I like that color for the face. I need it'll look better once I have like some black in there. And that's not so splotchy. <laughs> Mm. Weird. I think the glove on one arm is longer than the other. I think. You know what? I'm gonna act like it is. Oh, excuse me. <clears throat>
Uh, sword's not working out. I'm just going to go back over it. Let's see. These text messages could be a legal record at this point if court gets involved. Jesus. Well, that's way too much. Okay, I think that sword's a lost cause. Not, not very good at trying to achieve the metallic look. <clears throat> That's all right. Really? Uh, fuck. <laughs> I can... Black doesn't want to fill in all the way. I just... Oh, not worried about it. Any of the eyeballs. I don't even know if there's an eyeball in there. Oh, I'm, I'm going to need a smaller brush than that. Oh, God damn it. Well, I fucked that shit up. Okay, let's, let's 
let's try to get this black in here again. Black, black, and Maggie. I suck it. Don't know what's going on with the other eye socket because there really isn't an eye socket there. <laughs> then you got like this weird strand of hair. Not entirely sure what it's doing there. So uh, we're going to paint it red. Really? So, a little bit of a weird choice, but, eh. I think it works fine. And then... It's like all of this armor, which not the best. We're just going to say that. Apparently, according to where we live... Oh, you can withhold rent. Well, that's good news. Then you can finally, uh... Get things, uh, fixed around there. Which is, it's kind of stupid that you're having problems, because as I said, like, if, like, the carpet doesn't need to come up, and, like, there's just water in the carpet from a leak, like, that's, that's a, that's a pretty easy fix. That's, like, 
to what maybe like a 30 minute job to just go in there suck out all the water and put a put a fan in there like it's either that or replace the whole carpet when it gets moldy They were lazy and didn't bother to do it. Well, now you can hold their money. Until they do it. So. Doesn't even cost, doesn't even cost more to do. I think they would get it done. Well, I mean, you think they, sh you know, I imagine they have all the tools necessary. Oh dear, where is it? Let's see, one of the guys didn't want to fix it because they were scared of our plastic bags and deemed it unsafe. What do you mean, plastic bags? I see bags left over. I'm going to Walmart. Hmm. Well, I don't know what guy, what problem that that guy was. What that that guy's problem was. So, like, unless it's like a. Unless it looks like a hoarding situation, it's really no. <laughs> I 
not a whole lot of reason to deem it unsafe. Keep those together trash and stuff. Yeah. I mean, a lot of people do. Because, I mean, a guy refusing, refusing to do something over something as stupid as that, that's, uh, that, that's a landlord problem. Hmm. Let's see, you have a towel in the bathroom, in the bedroom, box in. We've done this several times over the last two weeks, and there's still water? The, then there must be, there must still be a leak somewhere. Because if it was, if it was water, or if it was, if, if the leak got fixed, and if it was just water, it would have, it would have gotten gross already, most likely. Yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure there's guarantee if, if you had if if you've had to do it several times over the past two weeks. Like Like I've seen I've seen I've seen what happens to to carpet when after after a leak it gets it gets real gross, but but it dries out. a little bit too much paint.
see they blame us really for not running our water during cold days because they didn't fix our faucet that we could well i mean unless it's like a 50 year old apartment you shouldn't have to because because most of the plumbing shouldn't be it it should it should be like pretty well pretty well insulated Like, what, when I, when, when I lived in a 100 year old house up in Washington, I didn't, I didn't, we didn't have to run the sinks. And when I lived in an apartment in South Dakota where it gets fucking super fucking cold, we, we never had to run our sinks. Well, that that sounds like a like that sounds like the owner's problem. See, the ground on the bathtub is groaning rotted. Ugh. You even had them fix it? It lasted a week? If grout lasted only, the, only a week, they probably didn't use grout. <laughs> At least they didn't use the correct kind. At at that point, I would just do that shit myself. I'd be like, "Fuck the cost." I mean, it's what? It's like five bucks to get. It's like it would be like it would be like ten bucks. Five bucks if you already have one of the little the little gun things. But th then again, I mean, you don't own you don't own the place, so I guess it's on it's on them if the if the inside of the walls get all moldy and gross, they'll eventually have to fix that. <laughs> Well, you know what? Fuck it. I'm not going to try to erase that. Uh, God, all the details. St st stupid small. I can hate it.
Yeah, I mean, just... I mean, you could start taking, you know, account of all the things and then start withholding rent. Then you gotta be careful about that also. Don't do it too many times. Or else they'll retaliate. <coughs> we'll start to retaliate. Which is also pretty illegal. But if they're pretty scummy, they won't give a shit. Alright. Yeah, you want to die from mold. <laughs> the place should be condemned. Yeah. Well... I mean, it's not not a whole lot you can do, unfortunately, if you're not able to find a new place to go. You're kind of trapped, yeah. Yeah, that sucks. It's hard to hard to break out of situations when you're uh not able to. Mainly financially. I mean... Hopefully one day, right? Me. <sighs> All right. I'm kind of painting this guy semi quickly. Not turning out too bad so far, though. So I'm happy with it. I'm gonna start out with purple.
Okay, so we got that. This guy's kind of looking like like a like a ghastly sort of not really just kind of has like the same little colors <laughs> 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 All right, and then we're going to actually Wait a second. Oh man. Oh. Hmm. Oh, fuck. Oh, I messed that up.
Then... Yeah, it looks okay. And I got like this. <laughs> this is what I should have done with the other model with this brown. Should have put like a base coat of something else. All right, that's a little bit better. All right. Oh, that's right. Try it. This little bag back here, which... Which I'll just quickly give a coat of paint to. Okay. We're gonna need to touch up the this hood a smidgen. Cause even with like a Putting a second coat on there, for some reason, it still looked like really splotchy. No, oh, that's. Too big of a brush. All right.
All right, that's all. Let uh, let me. I was gonna be like, oh, that's it for this guy. Let me fix that huge chunk of white there. Uh. I don't know what I should put for the base. Rock. Rocks, maybe. I can't really tell what it's on. Oh, there's uh... Maybe it's sand? Who fucking knows? Dirt? Yeah, it could be dirt. Yeah. Put some brown over it. See what happens when I put if I put brown over this, uh, this gray. It'll be an experiment to see what happens. It's like the feet kind of, like, droop in. Feet aren't standing solidly on something. All right, well... <clears throat> This one didn't turn out too bad. It was kind of a rush job. But still, not... No, that's not a terrible job. The gross mud dirt there. All right, well, I mean, that's pretty much going to be it for me today or tonight. Uh, Cosmo, are we doing Phasmo tomorrow? We doing some Phasmo Friday? What uh I mean that's what I did today, so I think we are oh Aries gonna be out. Alright. 
I mean, if he, it's just the three of us. Or the two of us, if, if Yuki isn't playing either. I need to buy more crabs. All right. All right. I mean, S3. S3, it'll be pretty good. I think it'll still be fine. Oh, God. All right. Just need to... Needed to turn off. Uh... Alright. Turn off that. Alright, so let's see here. Uh, oh, there's, there's the yawns. It's definitely sleepy time. Let's see here. Let's see. Gobs on. Aki's on. Let's see. Let's see. Day is playing some Splatoon 3. And Sethi is playing some Power World. <coughs> we'll, uh, we'll, we'll go raid Sethi. All right, well, uh, thanks everyone for coming to stream. Uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, I guess I'll be on tomorrow to play some uh, Phasmophobia with Cosmo and Yuki. So come, come watch that stream while we have some, some fun and shenanigans. Yeah, fun and shenan shenanigans. We like, we like some shenanigans. All right, Meta, you have, you have a nice night. All right. Anyways, thanks again for coming. I really, really appreciate it. Uh, so yeah, tomorrow, Phasmophobia, be there. Uh, we're going to go raid Sethi. They're playing, they're playing Power World. So we'll see, we'll see how he's doing there. All right, well, I will see uh, everyone later. You all have a good night and a great rest of your life, and I will see you later. Bye.